Hi, I'm George, TSG's HPI Product Manager. In this short demo, I'm going to overview HPI's proximity date control. So here we are on the search page for control documents, and let's say that my user really cares about the periodic view dates on the documents. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and do a search here for document number TSG and status effective. We'll go ahead and run that search. So it's going to come back with a bunch of documents, and I have my search set up to show the periodic review date. And it's kind of hard to tell uh, what documents are coming up on periodic review without really looking at this list. So what the proximity date control lets us do is easily narrow this down based on the date in proximity to today. Um, so we can quickly say, you know, show me all the TSG effective documents where the periodic review date is in the next, let's say, six uh, months. So now I'm going to rerun this search. And now it comes back uh, really quickly here with a list of documents uh, with their periodic review date in the next uh, six months. So if a document had a periodic review date after six months from today, uh, it's obviously not showing up in this list. And I can quickly come here and just change this to say, you know, maybe change it to the next three months, and now I just get back one document. So that's how this works on the search page, but we can also do it on the dashboard. So if I run over to my dashboard here, um, I can have a dashlet configured that says, show me the documents approaching periodic review. Um, and this was set up by the administrator uh, for the three month search. So any document um, that is periodic review is in the next three months will quickly show up here in this uh, nice dashlet. Um, so obviously this is just one example. We could do things like the approve date. Um, so I could say, show me documents that have been uh, approved within the last month. So this would search uh, forward and backward from today with one month. Um, and obviously it could be done for other types of documents. Like a, another good example would be contracts. So in a contract ma ma management scenario, I could say, um, you know, show me contracts that are expiring in the next three months or, you know, something of that nature. Well, that's it for this demo. Thanks for watching. For more information, check out our website at tsgrp.com.